Hello, I look a little crazy. I just blue dry my hair, but welcome back. And welcome to the last Vlogmas of 2022. Pretty sure um, I decided I was gonna do, if you're new, I'm doing like Monday through Friday, but this is the last one. Currently, I'm on a boat in the middle of the ocean, but <laughs> I'm going to be packing for my trip. So if you don't follow me on other social medias, I've probably been talking about this for way too long. Um, my dad, Rented a catamaran. We're flying into St. Thomas tomorrow morning, Sunday. So we get on the boat Monday morning and then we get off the following Monday. So a whole week on a boat going to see multiple different islands. I'm pretty sure we get to see a new island every day. I'm like, I can't contain my excitement. But I decided to do a little pack with me. This is the first thing that I am bringing. I actually just got, on the mail, got it in the mail today. So that's why... I had to try it on. It's from this brand is very overpriced. So I always try to find it on, you know, resale apps that this brand. First, we're gonna start off with going outfits. We're only gonna get off the boat for dinner three or four times. And the other times we're just gonna eat dinner on the boat. So we're gonna have a captain and his wife. The wife is like the cook and apparently she makes really good meals. So gonna be eating dinner on the boat, but only like three or four times and I'm still gonna look cute because do we know me? Like, duh. So this is one outfit I'm bringing. It's a jumpsuit, like an emerald green. I think it's like perfect because it's like Christmas colors, but it's not too, you know, crazy. Okay, I'm gonna change. This is how I'm gonna pack you guys. I ordered these packing cubes off of Amazon. I think for like 20 bucks, it's the best way to pack. The only downside about this trip is we can't pack in suitcases. We have to have duffels because I guess they don't want like the rolling wheels on the boat, which makes complete sense. I like to fold and then roll all of my things. I swear this helps with the wrinkles and it's just like smaller. Okay, where are my packing cubes? Let's get the biggest one probably. I'm gonna try to fit all of my dinner outfits I don't know why I'm quoting dinner. It's literally my dinner outfit. First is this green jumpsuit. Super cute. Next, I bought this maxi dress that is like, oh my God, these are gonna come out. I gotta tie this. It looks scary, doesn't it? I promise you guys. So in Tulum, if anyone's ever been, sometimes like people, you know, people will like walk down the beach and sell stuff. This girl was wearing in like, changing all of, into all these dresses. She was like walking down the beach in this red dress and I was like, oh, that is literally so cute. And then she put this purple one on and I was like, okay, come over here, lady. She came over and I was like, how much? <laughs> and then I paid her on the beach and took it home with me. And I haven't worn it yet, I got it. We went to Tulum last year for Christmas. So if you haven't watched those vlogs, you should because my family's hilarious. I'm gonna bring this little mini dress. I got this from Revolve. It twists in the front and it's like a really pr uh, pretty brown silk color. I feel like just like simple dresses are the easiest thing to pack. Next is this free people dress that I actually found in my mom's closet. Again, maxi dresses are the way to go. It's such a pretty pattern. I love that. And then open back. I guess I could go get a steamer. I love traveling with steamers. Okay, this dress is literally so freaking cute it's from a revolve i think yeah it's my friend Liv. she's letting me borrow it i think i'm gonna wear it on christmas because we decided we're gonna dress up like two like we're gonna dress up dress up for two nights um so this will be christmas dinner and then i'll show you guys the other dress i got from revolve is so cute okay then i'm gonna pack this like super casual these pants i feel like i'll like grab and wear like throughout the day as like a beach cover-up but i also could wear them at night i'm gonna pack of this cute corset top from For Love and Lemons. I'm literally obsessed with this. That will be, you know, one of those days where it's like more of a drinking day and then we have to eat dinner and I'm like hammered out of my mind. I'm just kidding, I'm kidding. I'm wanting to bring this one. It's giving Little House on the Prairie vibes and I feel like I won't wear it. But I'm like, the more, the more, the merrier. So we're packing it. It's like lace. I got it from Revolve and it was actually on sale for like $55 and it's originally like $200. Got in the mail and then realized why. I got this. Oh my God, you guys. We're going to take family pictures too. This sparkly 
it fits like a freaking glove. I mean, it's really tight, but super cute. Open back, strapless, all the way maxi. My boobs literally, you'll see in the Instagram. I think I'm going to post this like Friday after like a whole week of being on the boat. That's the plan. I'm trying to get all of my videos done for Vlogmas like now, but you know, it's hard. And then I'm going to bring this halter top from Anthropology, and I got these at Anthropology the other day. They're so cute. I'm obsessed with them. I feel like sitting on the boat, you know, dinner, and always bringing like one pair. And I'm scared it's going to get kind of chilly on the boat at night, just like with the wind and whatnot. Okay. That's about a lot of outfits. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. Nine. Okay. Let's just pack ten. This I got from Poshmark. It's the brand, the freaking brand that I love, but I don't have anything of. Mio, Mayo, whatever, however you pronounce it. I'm not really good at pronouncing if you guys haven't caught on yet. There we go. Moving on to... Oh, I also have this dress, but I'm not going to pack it. I got it from Anthology last year, and honestly, it's a little big on me, and I feel like if I pack it, it's kind of like a bigger, thicker material. Honestly, if I pack it, I feel like I won't wear it. Okay, let's do oh, pajamas slash like in the morning chilling, eating breakfast, drinking coffee. Don't get me wrong, I'm probably going to be sleeping in a t-shirt every night, but look how cute this is. It's getting prisoner, but... I kind of like it. <laughs> Those chilly, cloudy mornings. This cute free people set. I saw it as an ad and like this girl was like running through the beach and I was like, yep, that's, that's literally the perfect ad. I'm just folding these normally. Okay, we're gonna need two of these. And then these free people, or not free people, these are for love and lemons. Um, I've worn these before. Throw them, I like to know it. They're so freaking cute. It's a long sleeve in like booty shorts, basically. Okay, we're gonna need a bigger bag. Let me get these two. Okay, so we got two PJs, and then I'm gonna bring this like cute, comfy top that I got from Revolve. And then Maji sent me these really fun, tropical, flowy pants that I think are so freaking cute. Okay, so we got three. This PJ set from Anthropology. I've had this for like three years now. I love them. They have tigers on them. It's pants and then a long sleeve. Okay, so we have four little PJ hangout fits. Probably fit one more. And then I'm gonna bring this skim set. This is the boyfriend boxers and the little boyfriend tank in case it's like hot on the boat at night. And then I'm also gonna bring my Debo Samuel 49, oh wait, yeah, this is my Debo Samuel 49ers shirt. Um, I love Debo. If you didn't know, Debo went to South Carolina and he now is with the 49ers. A little tight squeeze. So that was what, five sleeping outfits. This sweatshirt from Aloe, it's just a comfy one. And then I have matching, Where'd they go? Matching shorts with it. So that's six. I feel like that's probably good. And then a oh, silk long sleeve with silk bottoms to match. I think my friend Mason actually gave me that. I don't have an idea where that's from. I feel like we should bring something else. Maybe this, yeah. I got this from Beach Riot. I think this is so cute. And like if it's cold, that would be perfect just to have in the bag. I'm overpacking. I know you guys don't, literally don't tell me that because I know that. Huh. Okay. I'm also gonna just pack like a biker set. I'm only gonna pack one of them. I'm not even packing tennis shoes or socks, so it's not like I'm gonna be working out on the boat, but you never know. Maybe I'll do some yoga. <laughs> Probably not. Okay, next are my bathing suits and cover-ups. I have ants in my pants, as well as my father and my whole family. Therefore, I started picking out which bathing suits I wanted to pack on Monday. It's literally Saturday, y'all. So, let's just go through all the stuff that I have. Also, can we take a, pic or a moment for how cute this duffel is? It's so cute. And then I have my noble duffel, too. All right. Where do we begin? 
Let's just start with the bathing suits. And then we'll try to match the bathing suits with the cover-ups. <sighs> Let's see. I feel like I'm like this looking, you guys are looking down on me. It's kind of freaking me out. That's way better. Okay. First bathing suit is this hot pink one. Probably no one like say anything about the amount of bathing suits I'm packing, okay? This brand sent me this bathing suit. It's so freaking soft. It feels like silk. It's from this brand. I don't know how to pronounce. Sina? Sima? I don't know if that's an N or an M. And then I always pack in these cute little triangle bags. They come with um, bathing suits that you get. So that's one. We're going to pack. I don't see myself wearing this triangle skirt. Um, this black triangle one. It's just your normal triangle bathing suit. That looks so small, but it's not. And the bottoms tie. I think I wear a medium and triangle. Um, super freaking cute. And then same thing, but in green. It's literally the same one. Same triangle, both size medium. Such a cute. Oh, wait. We need to... We're going back. So with the pink bathing suit, what cover-up am I going to be wearing with it? I think possibly this one from Boho. It's really cute. Crochet. Giving grandma, but she's cute. Back sparkly one i'm thinking what about just black shorts let's just do black shorts for that one it's green one you guys on christmas i'm planning on wearing this green one on christmas and i'm gonna wear this see-through cover-up from for love and lemons y'all i'm so extra i'm so, i love it literally love myself for that i got two cover-ups three bikinis this other pink one which is so cute. I got this on Revolve on sale with that. Maybe these pants. These pants from Beach Riot. They're like flare pants. I think that would be a cute cover up piece. So we have one, two, three. Oh my God, this one's like my favorite one I got. This is from Bitey. Um, what's going on? Did it break? <laughs> guys was i not just saying this is my favorite one it's fine okay that looks like really small but it fits me I've tried it on here are the bottoms well there are the bottoms that is that one's on my cheekier side okay you don't have you can leave your comments down below about that and then i got this on poshmark this is a for love and lemons white cover up with a bunch of different cutouts i feel like i'm gonna wear this like multiple times different suits one day we're gonna like go off and kind of do like a safari and like a jeep so that's why i'm gonna bring two pairs of jean shorts okay this next suit is so cute again bitey is probably my favorite actually it is my favorite bathing suit company like by far so freaking cute i'm obsessed that one i'm probably I wear the white skirt. I got this white skirt off Revolve. Honestly, I could wear this like later to dinner too. If I wanted to. This is also from Bidey, you guys. I mean, they never miss. They really don't miss. And then I have the same style in white. This is from Revolve. I got it like last year. Today's kind of don't fit and the bottoms are a little big, but it's always good to bring a white bathing suit anywhere you go. Um don't ask me why i just think it is last but not least wait i lost count of bathing suits i feel like that was probably plenty this one is from house of cb which i didn't even know they had bathing suits okay <laughs> you guys it fits it looks really small but it's not it fits it's like a cute little purple flowery pattern and then tie bottoms wait tie bottoms super cute i showed you guys the cover-ups and then this cover-up is from house of cb as well it's like a little skirt and then a long sleeve shirt to go over the bathing suit from house of cb i'm gonna bring this though because i got this on revolve it's frankie's bikini and it's like i think this would be cute on christmas look how cute this cutout is it looks like li it's giving like lifeguard and i'm also gonna bring this white tank I feel like you can never go wrong with just throwing on a white tank with jean shorts. It ties also from House of CB. 
Um, if you guys want me to link anything, just comment and let me know because I will. Cover up, just like long sleeve. Also really good if it gets cold at night just to throw this guy on. And guys, I think we're like... Wait, I feel like I'm like done. OMG, I can't believe I almost forgot. My family's matching pajamas. Please, it says Merry Christmas in every language. <laughs> I think my mom got them from Nordstrom. <sighs> we always like go places for Christmas, so I feel like this is very fitting. We usually, I don't, I don't even know y'all. My dad, if you didn't know, my dad is like extremely fluent. Like, like he's very, 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 very good at speaking Spanish. Like, if you heard him talk, you guys would be like, oh my god, is, did he live in Mexico for a while? How does he know that? And he literally taught himself. That's how motivated and, like, my dad wants something done. You sure bet that it's going to be done. That's where I get a lot of my, like, I'm squeezing these with my inner thighs. <laughs> Please close. Um... Like, growing up, seeing my dad be so motivated really, like, inspired me to be motivated. That was kind of sad. But it's fine. Okay, we need, like, one bigger packing bag. I don't know. I have so many triangle bags, so let's do our cover-ups. Our. Mine. So, bathing suits. Bathing suits. Going right here. I have an apple tag that I'm gonna put in this in case someone decides to really ruin my day. Okay, cover up. I'm kind of impressed with myself. I'm kind of, I wonder how long this video has been going because I feel like I'm kind of getting it done. Me trying to pack this on the way back is going to be humorous. <laughs> Me putting my foot on this little tiny cube. I'm trying to zip this. Also, Rosie got picked up this morning. It was so sad. I'm not going to see her for like over like 10 days. That's so long. We're almost done. Next. Oh, God, you guys. Oh, my God. It's really cool. Okay, we're going to have to. I'm just gonna put this little cover up in my carry on. Do you guys think I would wear this? A lot of my bathing suits are like patterned, so I'm gonna bring this orange one instead. Really cute. I think I got it at like some random boutique in Orange County. I'm obsessed with it. Good thing to just have in your bag. And and then we have denim shorts and a goldie black shorts. One duffel down. So, oh my God, y'all, I didn't pack any underwear or bras. Okay, let's do that really quick. Do I need any sports bras? No. I'll bring one pair of fuzzy socks or two pairs of fuzzy socks. And then maybe this. Bra, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This will go in this little bag. So probably need to wear tennis shoes because it's going to be like cold in Georgia, but it's going to be so warm when we land. So I think that's like the hardest part about getting out. That's not going to work. They better <laughs> accept this. Okay, so we have all my clothes, right? So what am I wearing on the way there? We should have started with that. Okay, this is what I came up with, but I don't think that I like it. <laughs> I feel like my toes are gonna be freezing. Okay, airport fit. 
y'all see it later, but I'm just gonna pack like yoga pants and a sweatshirt for the ride back. First bag, all my clothes done. Moving on to shoes and accessories. So I'm just gonna pack like a few sandals, like these would be good for dinner. Um, these would also be good for dinner fit. Shoes, shoes. I'm banking on my mom bringing hair stuff, so I'm gonna pack actually my shoes in this. This is like why the weekender is like my favorite because you can put your shoes on the bottom and your shoes don't even have to touch any of your clothes, which is literally so nice. Um, then I have my rainbows, which I will probably be wearing every day. And I got these on sale, some random freaking website, but they're kind of cute. So we're gonna pack those as well. Part of me just knows that I'm gonna want slippers in the morning, so I'm packing slippers. Um, I might be packing too many shoes. I literally don't care. I'm gonna pack these, even though my mom told me not to bring heels. I like heels, so I'm gonna go in this bag on the bottom, because these haven't been worn, so that'll be fine. Um, the rooms on the boat, you guys are like pretty small, as you can imagine, it's a boat. <laughs> and I'm gonna scare my bags, they're gonna quite literally take up all the space. Okay, all my shoes packed. <sighs> I'm putting an apple tag in this one, just cause I can. This purse I got in Tulum, that, this is a fake Dior bag, and then you guys, look how cute this is. I just got this fake YSL. I mean, I definitely have a few real ones, but at the end of the day, no one cares. Two, three, four. That was from Revolve like a while ago. Shoes. And then I'm gonna bring this cute company sent me this little bucket hat. Maybe I'll wear it. And then this cute little beach bag. It's called the Beach People. How cute. I love to overpack you guys. It's quite hilarious. So in this bag, it's all my tanning products. I'm bringing this Maui Babe. My Aquaphor for my tattoo, which I'm not supposed to get wet for two weeks, but YOLO, um, it doesn't really matter. It's tiny. And then Tula face sunscreen. This cutie bag with all of my jewelry. And then I just went upstairs and stole um, a bunch of cute bracelets. My mom has literally so many pieces of jewelry. So we're just gonna borrow. And then I got some hair ties. Um, we got some glow screen. Some more glow screen for my body. A razor. Two razors. I don't know why. Lip stuff. Face stuff. Body chain. Another body chain. And that's it for that bag. So that's like my during the day what I need. Parents went to Exuma a few weeks ago, and my dad, I have a video of it, my dad is drunk trying to do pistols, which is like a one leg squat. So there will be some kind of competition going on in our family. Okay, I almost broke that. Look how cute this bag is from everything but water. So I still have my sunscreen. And then this bag, I have deodorant, my Tula body lotion, got perfume, razor, and then I got this from Amazon. It's Shampoo, conditioner, face wash, body wash, hair oil, toothpaste, body oil for my skin, hair stuff, hair stuff, and then purple shampoo. Just in case my hair gets like, you know, when you go in the ocean, your hair will get like kind of change colors. Yeah, I don't want that to happen. I'm really scared this is gonna spill. Why is it all oily? Oh, shitters. I need to get a plastic bag for that. Then, here we got my acne medicine, my daily pills, I eye patches when I'm hungover, and then I have my green powder. You guys are probably like, damn, this is gonna come back the same way it looks. I'm gonna turn it back. Trying to be good, okay? 
Oh my carry on, I just got this back from Free People. I'm packing this hat in that hat because I think they're really cute. And sometimes like after being in the sun for a while, I don't like, um, like it's bad for your hair, especially if you're blonde. This is so cute, I'm gonna pack this. So this is my makeup. Um, just put it in this triangle bag. I literally packed in all the triangle bags. I swear it's the best. My brother got me this for Christmas. I'm gonna pack this. It's a little milk mirror, light up mirror. Just pack that in the carry on. Why is this carry on Loki huge? And then I got my digital camera. My brother got me this um, leather thing. I'm so excited. Wait, let me make sure. Cameras. It's so cute. And it's like. Um, vintage looking then we got a little mount for my phone little light up thing in case I need that we got chargers which I don't even know what those are for you can pack probably a little bit more in there wait I did good My weekender with shoes and bathing suits and my healthy stuff. My little juicy bag with all my cameras and chargers. And then, wait, you guys. All I have left is, wait, I don't even have anything left. I'm not packing my computer. I think I told you guys that because that was like the whole thing. Like, I didn't want to have to work I'm there because it's a vacation. My family and my parents will probably kill me. Makeup. Yeah, both my duffels. Ready to go. I just need to go get a plastic bag for that body oil. And then clean up a little bit. This place is a mess. Not bringing that. I need to charge my Apple Air AirPods. I need a pack. I kind of want to bring my Stanley Cup. Ah, roll out. Outfit tomorrow. I'm gonna bring it. Okay, this is the charger for the digital camera, and then we got an extra battery in the camera charger for my vlog camera. Chill. I'm so excited. That's, that's gonna be fun. I'm, gonna I'm uh, filming a video of packing right now. That's why I probably wasn't good. answering you. You're good, I was Wait, I'm, that's yeah. not. I am like. That time was fun. I wish you were there. But it was, was fun. Like, yeah, it was like one of those. Like, I don't care the last time. I'm about to. Well, I signed my biggest brand deal yet. Very nice. I was like shit right now. I'm so. I think I'm done packing. I'm gonna pack a sweatshirt in. So what are you thinking about for your parents? Quick little intermission because I had to go um, get all my things that I need. So, passport, wallet, important. These are gonna go in a little front zipper right there. Then we got some sunglasses. I'm probably gonna buy a pair of sunglasses at the airport because I always do when I fly international. Got my new Pradas. This bag. We got my Ray-Bans, Aviators. Yeah, I'm definitely buying a new pair of sunglasses. And then Aquaphor is gonna go in the little pocket as well. Some gum right there. Lipstick, I need to put this in my makeup bag. I've been eating the applesauce. My mom just got Chick-fil-A for lunch. I got my two duffels and two carry-ons. We are ready to go. Flight's at 11, or no, 12 I think tomorrow. But it's 1 p.m. right now. There's football going on. So, 
but I was chilling on the couch and edit the last two Vlogmas videos I have and go to sleep early because, oh, and we're gonna, every year we always watch Christmas Vacation. Like my dad's in tears every single year watching it. So we're gonna watch that tonight because we obviously can't watch it on the boat. And this is the end of Vlogmas. So I hope you guys enjoy it and subscribe because the vlogs coming for this trip are going to be quite terrifying, but really fun. All right, love you guys.